is the end of things. What the f Why are you so fixated on me? Because you're my friend. Just give up and let me cut you down already! This world shall go pain. It's time you woke up. It's all over. Hello guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Naruto Shippuden episode 499, guys. One episode left officially after this one, and I'm just bra, man. Come on, it's all coming to it, man. It's it's really, man. First off, we've we've been over 500 episodes. That's a lot of freaking episodes, man. Man, that's a lot of episodes. I'm, man, listen, this journey was something else. And I really, I can't wait to talk uh, to you guys about everything, about my favorite characters, my, my favorite arcs, what, what what made me emotional the most and all that. You know, there's a lot of topics that I got messages from you guys. You would like to hear my thoughts on it. So, yeah, we're, we're going to do that. But I'm just, right now, at, 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 in this moment, I'm enjoying the ride and just, you know, finishing it off with, uh, with uh, probably with tears. <laughs> but, guys, listen, uh, I ain't going to prolong this that much. If you enjoy my reactions, feel free to share, subscribe, like, leave a comment, ring that for notifications guys follow me on instagram join my discord server and my patreon page without further ado man let's jump right into this reaction oh uh, let's go <sighs> what a dilemma okay what's the matter lord kakashi let me guess he got all the gifts and now it's up to him to finally make a decision who's gonna be attending the wedding who's gonna be on a mission to guard the village so yeah that is a tough one Please, just drop the Lord part. <laughs> Remember the mission I gave to get wedding gifts? Um, do I really have to assess every one of them? Of course you do. <laughs> you can tell that Team 8 really went all out. And this Hot Springs honeymoon and the gift certificates for dinner are very thoughtful, too. Yeah, I mean, I I, I'm telling you, Ten Ten and Lee are gonna lose this because, come on, dumbbells and a kunai knife? Can you, man, listen. Expecting this from Choji and Shikamaru, they outdid themselves. Yeah. Take a look at this. <laughs> Dumbbells. <laughs> Unbelievable, right? Now they can be the ones given assignments on the day of the wedding. Come on, you can't really assign Konohamaru to protect the village. He's not strong enough. I mean, right? Guy's in a wheelchair. What is he gonna do? Beat him up with his head? And I mean, I guess Lee can't do it, but... Yeah, I mean, Ino and Sakura, they, they got frames. I mean... It's not a bad gift, but uh, right? They didn't really go all out, but okay, it's I guess. It's true that if I'm supposed <laughs> to make my selections based on the gifts, then these three should be the candidates. Plus, Konohamaru not turning into tape? Come on, that's one of the best gifts, actually. So if he just turns it, uh, right? If, if he gives the tape to Kakashi, it's going to be one of the best presents, man. Let's be honest. It's sentimental. Oh, Hinata. <laughs> Why did he... It's been a while, hasn't it? Re react that <laughs> What's way. What's up? I take it Naruto's doing well? Huh? Yes, he's fine. <laughs> he's doing really well. Why is he... <laughs> yes, he's doing fine. <laughs> like, why are they so awkward? Like, what is happening? <laughs> Where are you headed, Kakashi-sensei? Oh, I'm hoping to take a quick nap. <sighs> She's like, ah, oh, you fool, you could have asked her to join you. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> the ramen was delicious as always. It isn't that. I knew that you'd be here, Iruka-sensei. Oh, he's still recording. Konohamaru. No. Wait, he still hasn't given in his... Oh, what the hell is wrong with you, Iruka? Just speak from the heart, man. Just speak from the heart like Gada, man. Come on! More delays. I need your congratulatory message. Because otherwise, I can't turn in this video as my wedding gift. Yeah. Now get ready, because I'm recording. <laughs> hey, wait! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, How can anyone not know what to say in a congratulatory message? You're Naruto's teacher, well, aren't you? Damn. That's the reason why! Stop it! <laughs> All of you, what is wrong with you people? Also, you guys told me that the ramen guy, Teuchi, is that his name? Something like that? Listen, you guys translated what he wrote on that little bra. He gave him free ramen for life. 
Are you serious? This man is just precious, bro. This man needs to be protected at all costs, man. He needs to have monopoly over the ramen shop in, in the entire Fire Nation, bro. What is happening? This man really gave him... Uh, man, Naruto's gonna close him. <laughs> that boy eats, like, everything in here. So, and he got a coupon, like, for, for life. Free ramen for life. He has a big heart, man. He has a big heart. That is? Back when Lord Kazekage came into Ichiraku. I am going to honor Naruto. Not as Kazekage, but as a friend. Yeah, man! When I heard him say that, I began to wonder in what role exactly I should be celebrating Naruto. You're a father figure, bruh! Thing is, I kind of feel like this shouldn't be coming from the point of view of a teacher to his student. Come on. I also don't think it's really right to call us friends in the way Lord Kakashi spoke of. Bruh, you're a father figure. You're you're a role model. You're you're a man. Come on. Come on, man. Come on. So you see, the more that I think about it all, the more unsure I become about my message for him. And is all the prep for the wedding done? Nice. Yes. Well, most of it. I'm sorry. I'm always gonna say it. They're fired as hell. <laughs> All of them. It, bro. That's uh. That's the. I. I really like. Sakura is so beautiful. Hinata is just precious, bro. And you know, bro. Even Tenten is just. You know, bro. My vein is popping up. Like what the hell? <laughs> Anyway, do you remember when Iruka actually, you know, when, when, when Naruto was training to control Kurama, you know, and, and then he didn't even know that war was going on outside, and then he sussed it out, and he came out, and everybody was trying to stop him, and Iruka left him a note in, in the headband. Come on, man. You could really see what a role model uh, Iruka really was uh, to Naruto. So come on, Iruka, you can't tell me you do not know how to approach this. Just tell him you're proud of him, man. I I'm sure it will mean a lot. Let's go. I have to say, I'm really surprised that the first ones out of our entire group to get married are you and Naruto. Bro, look at Ino, bro. Ino is just listen. Ino, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna simp over Ino forever, bro. Sa is a lucky man. But anyway, you guys told me that when Asuma died, he actually his last words to Ino were not to let Sakura beat her uh, at being a shinobi or love. So. Ino became hot as hell! How's Naruto doing, anyway? <laughs> Is he even helping you at all with the planning? <laughs> of course. <laughs> I guess that planning a wedding is a huge task, huh? Yeah, of course it is. Even for us, like how Kakashi Sensei gave us. <laughs> Damn, that was close. Oh, yeah, they can't reveal that they got gifts and all. Okay, okay. <laughs> That's just weird. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> that is like, uh, my kunai knife is the best gift ever. <laughs> what was that about Kakashi-sensei? I mean... <laughs> you already have someone like Naruto, so you're really lucky. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Are you going to wear boy. a kimono for the ceremony? You're going to look really pretty as a bride no matter what you wear. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, so wait, my boy's just walking around trolling every chick like, Ooh, everybody, like, what is happening? He was a, everybody knows that he's a fugitive and now he's on the loose. Like, everybody, can, oh, yeah, this man experimented for a centuries uh, with people, with our children, and now he's just roaming free. Really? Nobody has a problem with that? <laughs> but listen, yeah, jokes aside, Hinata's gonna be a lovely bride, man. That's just gonna, I can't wait. I really hope they show the wedding, man. Come on, come on. Hinata! <laughs> we hardly ever get to see him anymore these days. Although, he's been busy with missions, but I can still oh. count on him to help with the wedding, too. Oh, yeah? I, I was we about to say, what the hell is Naruto doing to, to, right? We're not seeing him on the screen at all. So how, how much invested is he in this wedding? <laughs> like, right? But okay, if he's doing missions, I get it then. Just completed a mission ourselves, and I'm sure that it's going to make you happy. Keep up! Huh? Bro, oh, that was close. That's hilarious. Oh. Boink, boink. Huh? 
it's actually now that I think about it, it's, it's quite surprising that Hinata is marrying Naruto. I know that she's simped over him for the entire series, and I get it. But you know, the Hyuga usually marry Hyuga, like Uchiha married Uchiha, like right? Somebody actually told me if Neji didn't die, they'd probably make her marry Neji, even though they're cousins, or right? So that's kind of you know, because because to keep the bloodline pure, as they say. So I'm kind of surprised that they're actually letting Naruto in their clan, so to speak. Tsunade! <gasps> Lady Tsunade! So what did you want? What's up? <laughs> right. Actually, it's about Lord Kakashi. Kakashi? Okay. Yes. We have that rule on the books about assessing the gifts the invited shinobi will present in order to determine who will be allowed to attend the wedding, right? Oh, yeah, I remember. And therefore, who he's going to have to eliminate from the wedding ceremony. When you think Let me guess, Konohamaru is gonna hear about this and that he's not gonna turn in the tape without Iruka's declaration because that's valuable, bro. Iruka just, you know, has a special place in Naruto's heart. If anyone's excluded... That's probably going to make Naruto and Hinata very sad. That's true. This is really bad. Yeah. I mean, I'm telling you, why not just make, like, you know, make them marry in the middle of Konoha, and that way, if anybody attacks, they'll be just, you know, like Superman, just get out of your gown and fight. <laughs> and as for the missions, I'm sure you can survive one day without missions. Come on. Gifts she's are going to be judged to determine who's allowed to attend the wedding? She's gonna What's hear the it. Meaning of this? I don't get it. Why? Hey, come on, stop. I mean, it's not my fault. Most of the shinobi in the village will want to attend Naruto and Hinata's wedding ceremony. Yeah. However, there are still gonna be missions that day. I didn't think that our wedding would cause so much trouble. Man. This whole thing's been bothering Kakashi Sensei, too. That makes sense. Why did it have to turn into such a big thing? Bruh, just everybody make a Shadow Clone and just, you know, you're strong enough that Shadow Clone can, uh, right? Everybody makes a Shadow Clone. Hell, Naruto can make 27,000 Shadow Clones and just surround the city. What are you talking about? This ain't, this ain't a big problem. Well, because Naruto's You're bond is with the whole village, not just us. Do we just sit and wait to be judged? I don't think <laughs> there's going to be any need. I'll take on the dirty work, and that'll be that. Me too. I want everyone to attend the wedding, so I will volunteer for duty. Yeah. Bruh. Bruh. Who's the man? What? Go back two or three reactions ago. What did I say? Just raise this man. Come on. I Man, listen. I said this. They're true friends. Somebody's going to volunteer if they just knew about this problem. And of course, Lee, my man, I mean, he would have lost anyway. I mean, freaking dumbbells. How dumb can you be? But listen, he's pure, man. Lee and Shikamaru volunteered. Come on. Of course they would. Hey, man, they just want Hinata and Naruto to have a great time, man. Just save them some cake and that's it. I'll do it too. Fine. Sign me up. If Team 8 isn't there, Hinata's going to be really sad. But still... I, I mean, don't that's feel true. Okay about somebody else missing the wedding. Come on. They made her sad before the wedding. It's better get back. Oh, she came to him. Kakashi Sensei. Huh? <gasps> What's wrong, Hinata? What happened? I heard about the dilemma you're facing, and it's all because of our wedding. Huh? What? She knows. You found out? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and the mission? Yes. Everything? Yes. Oh, I see. <laughs> Listen, I would never want to put anyone through trouble just to celebrate our wedding day. Huh? Uh, no, 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 no. The day of your wedding is a happy day for your clan, too, isn't that right? That, that's true. As Hokage, I have to make sure your whole family can be there for you. So for now... Just focus on yourselves, that's all. Actually, I'd better get back. See ya. Come on. I mean, Kakashi's pure, he's trying to help, and of course he's not gonna let her forfeit their wedding or anything like that, but... 
Yeah, this is a dilemma, bro. They formed connections throughout the entire village, and nobody can be absent, right? And like I said, the only solution is shadow clones, bro. You're strong enough? Come on, man. Sasuke and Naruto alone can create, right? And they can just surround the village and, and even go on missions. What? What's this all about? We all know about Naruto and Hinata's wedding, and that we can't <laughs> all be there. Okay. Everyone here will handle the assignments that day. But if you do that, Naruto and Hinata are going to be sad that you aren't there. Yeah. And that's why we're going to the wedding as well. What do you mean? If everybody puts in a little time, then all of us can still be there to wish them well. After okay, that's a good plan. That hadn't even occurred to me. Yeah, they can do shifts, so everybody's got a chance, just not the whole duration of the bra. That, that's, like I said, man, they're all friends. Of course they're going to figure this they're out. All. Helping each other out is something that Naruto taught us. Well, this way you won't have to bear the whole burden. I'll think of another solution. You'll just drown. What? Besides, there's no need for all that. Lady Tsunade... Look, Lord Sixth, the thing is, that rule was made back during a time when there was a sudden upswing in shinobi weddings. Plus, okay. it was during the Great War. The situation's different now. It's peace. You will choose to let us all volunteer to work, right? Sorry, I can't. What? But why not? What? <laughs> My job is to find a way for everyone who wants to celebrate alongside Naruto and Hinata to be able to attend the wedding. No one leaves early or comes late. I'll think of something. How? Like, aside from Shadow Clones, I don't see a way. Maybe, maybe if he asks Gada to lend him some people from the sand or something like that, right? But you can't really rely on, right? So I, I don't know. Yuruka-sensei. What's the matter? <laughs> did Naruto do something he did, didn't he? I knew it! Come on. My boy's good, man. As a favor to me, please forgive Naruto. <laughs> please, I'm begging you. <laughs> this man went all out <laughs> without even knowing what's happening. <laughs> but you decided that Naruto must have done something wrong and started to apologize. Oh, so he didn't. <laughs> This wedding isn't really just for us. After all, Naruto's a hero who connects every village. Facts. I was probably just being naive and only thinking about marrying the man that I've loved for so long. Nah. You're wrong about that, Hinata. Yeah. Huh? No matter how big a hero he may be to me and to everyone else, Naruto will always be Naruto. Nothing will change our desire to wish you both the best. So don't think of this as a big fuss. <laughs> Man. Although I do understand how Hinata feels, Naruto's become someone that connects everyone in every village together. Yep. Did you say every village? You know what the solution is now? You what? I'm just gonna have to bow my head a little, that's all. <laughs> He's gonna go and ask Agata or Raikage or somebody to lend him some people so they can... Yeah, right? Because it's peace, man. They're not at odds anymore. He can trust them. And yeah, that's a, that's a good solution. But the Shadow Clone thing, that was also a good solution. Come on, guys. Tell me in the comments. How would you fix this? I mean, they made a huge deal out of nothing. Like, you're ninja. You have ways. I know you're in there. I heard you. Come on now. I need to record your message or I won't have a wedding gift. Well then, Konohamaru, I think it's time you got to work. Huh? I... What? Uh, what now? <laughs> I sincerely implore you. Please, raise your head, Lord Six. Respect. Oh, Raikage, Tsuchikage, Mizukage and I have talked about what we can do. Means that we'd be happy to cooperate with you. Hell yeah, this man! This is all possible because of the peaceful bonds that were forged through Naruto's strength. Actually, may I be so bold as to ask for one more favor? You only have to ask. <laughs> They're gonna uh, video record! Come here, Konohamaru. His message! Yes, Gara, say something. What should I say? <laughs> Just make up a proverb or something. Come on! Speak from the heart! I okay, can't come up with a proverb, but... <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> 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 
That's my boy. That's my boy. He's like, hey, you remember who I am? I am the desert monster. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. First off, I'm surprised by the technology they have now, right? Like video cameras, and like their technology is on par with ours. Like, what the hell? My boy's just recording everybody, right? Do they have cell phones too? That's dope, man. That's dope. Listen. That was funny in the end. God is like, get off of me! Sand coffin! <laughs> but yeah, that was that was a good solution, man. Just go and ask your friends, bro. Come on! God to the rescue! Inuka to the rescue! Everybody to the rescue! That was lovely, man. They, they even made me tear up, man. This episode was good, man. This, this, and, and I'm guessing the next episode is gonna be the wedding, but then again, maybe not. I don't know, man. It's just, maybe they're just gonna show them, like, right at the altar or something like that. That's dope, man. Man, that's dope. That's dope. But I'm just, I'm in my, mind. I'm, I'm in my emotions right now because this is ending, and one episode left. I'm gonna be jumping right into this, obviously. But come on, man, that they're so precious. Everybody's just doing everything they can to make this a very special day for Naruto and Hinata, and it's been such a long journey, such a long way, and they, they do deserve it, man. They do deserve it. One question though: Is Sasuke gonna be at the wedding? And is he gonna bring a gift? And is he gonna ask Sakura to go with him? Uh, what is gonna happen, right? That Because he has to be at the wedding. Come on, Naruto can't, right? <laughs> so, yeah, that's dope. That's dope. That's dope. I'm really excited about this, man. I mean, excited and sad at the same time because we're ending this wonderful journey that this channel was based on. So, now we just, we're gonna just be left with talking about it. But listen. I'm glad I, I, I stumbled upon this journey and I'm glad my friends made me start this and you know in the end it really panned out man I, I started this not expecting anything from this show but bro, <laughs> this is just amazing okay I really enjoyed this ride so guys one episode left I ain't gonna this that much I really enjoyed this episode hope you enjoyed the reaction and I'll see you in the next one the last one love you guys